and gentlemen, I think we all agree the beating heart of a car is under its hood. Now this also decides whether the driver's heart is beating faster. The S class certainly makes the hearts of engineers beat faster. Why is that? Well, if you ask the engine guy, this is due to it coming with three completely new engines. An inline six cylinder diesel, an inline six cylinder gasoline engine, and a V8 bi-turbo gasoline engine. Tomorrow you will have the opportunity to experience these new engines for yourself in the S-Class. For the three different engine variants, we had a single development aim. The perfect combination of top level performance, utmost efficiency, and low emissions. Let's take a look, a close look at the diesel first. Our new OM656 shows that there is a future in diesel. It comes in two power variants with 286 horsepower in the S350 and with 340 horsepower in the S400. The standard consumption of both is well below 6 liter mark. In other words, we have around 10% more power than with the predecessor and at the same time around 7% less consumption. We achieved that using a host of technical innovations. The combination of steel pistons and a full aluminum crankcase ensures much less friction. The same applies for the cylinder wall coating using the nanoslide procedure. The position of the exhaust gas after treatment system near the engine and additional insulation measures reduce heat losses. That too increases the efficiency and lowers the emissions, especially in the case of cold starts. Equally new is the two-stage turbocharger, which ensures a sporty kick and confident driving performance. All in all, our new diesel engine sets new milestones in terms of cleanliness and efficiency, while delivering outstanding dynamics. Well, outstanding dynamics brings us to an absolute highlight. Maxi already mentioned it. Our new inline six-cylinder M256 engine. What makes this uh, that engine so special? One aspect is its 48 volt onward electrical system. On the one hand, we can now use an integrated starter alternator, and we can also beltlessly drive auxiliary units like the water pump and the climate control compressor. On the other hand, unlike with a high voltage electrical system, we do not need additional safety mechanisms. All in all, the vehicle is thus more dynamic and more efficient. Thanks to the boost function, we can achieve particularly fast acceleration, and we do so completely without turbo lag, thanks to a new additional electric compressor. What's more, we can switch off the engine more frequently. You can feel this when coasting at high speeds, for example. And let me make one short remark here. Uh, I already talked to one lady saying, I really like the sport mode. Go ahead, drive the sport mode. It's going to be a lot of fun, but try the E mode as well, because that switching off the engine is especially uh, frequent in the E mode, so please try it out. Uh, you're going to love it too, I promise. Well, thanks uh, to the possibility of recuperation, additionally, we can recover up to 80% of braking energy. As you can see, the borderline between conventional engines and hybrid drives is disappearing. By the way, we will soon supplement our range of drive systems by a plug-in hybrid. Uh, this offers a purely electric range of around 50 kilometers. And just as an aside, the 48 volt electrical system is also leading the way for further expanding our infotainment and assist assistance systems. The six-cylinder gasoline engine also comes in two variants on the S-Class. One with 367 horsepower in the S450 and S450 formatic models, and another with 435 horsepower in the S500. As you can see, we provide the power of an eight-cylinder engine with much lower fuel consumption. Impressive figures, still, some customers might look for a little more. For example, when it comes to the number of cylinders, and then you take our M176 with two more cylinders. We use this top performing unit in the S560 formatic 
and the Mercedes Maybach S five four six S five S five sixty. Difficult. Both with an output of four hundred and sixty nine horsepowers. Thanks to our cylinder deactivation, we have managed to achieve a new level of efficiency here too. All these qualities, as well as an extra helping of performance, will all <clears throat> will also come to the S63 with our new V8, but this, uh, my colleague Simon Thomas uh, will tell you more about this later. All our new gasoline engines also feature a particular filter, which will soon become a requirement, has already been in place in the S-Class since 2014. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you will agree with our new engines. The S-Class highlights, <coughs> highlights its role as the leader of its segment. Thank you.